God is always at work in His people. There's no greater honor, there's no higher calling than what God has put for the purpose of marriage. This evening, you both stand in the reality of God's promise. For forming His family, He brings a man and a woman together, and it is God who brought Eve to Adam, and He sealed the noble honor of marriage that two would become one. God's Word, reminding James Allen and Taylor they take on the responsibility today of husband and wife to live in a way that truly honors God. The Word of God tells us that marriage is honorable, that we're to conduct ourselves without coveting the world, but also with a promise that God will never leave us to obtain this marriage that God has for us. It starts with both of you, submitting your life to the Lord Jesus Christ. together on this evening to celebrate the marriage of James Allen Bryant and Taylor Everett. The Bible commands the man to love his wife as Christ loves the church. And Taylor, the Bible calls for you to be a virtuous woman. Strength and honor guide you as your journey leads you into a joyous relationship with your husband. Take you, Taylor, as my lawful wedded wife. I, Taylor, take you, James Allen, to be my lawful wedded husband. I promise to love and cherish you as Christ loves the church. I promise to be faithful, believing God has put us together for marriage in His eyes. I promise to be a godly husband that prays the very best for you all of your days. So death only separates us. What God has joined together, let no man tear apart. James Allen, you may kiss your bride. It is my privilege to present to you Mr. and Miss James Allen Bryant.
Father God, we are indeed grateful for your blessings and thankful, God, for what you're going to do in this couple for the rest of their days. And Father, we make covenant with you today that you will bless them and use them for the furtherment of your kingdom in Jesus' name. Amen.